feel like I should be concerned with this number of creepy, shadowy people watching me sleep. Aha! Uh -huh. Alright, everybody, welcome to another episode of Shadows of the Colossus. This is your host, Aaron. We have just defeated the seventh Colossi. Almost halfway through this. I do want to apologize for the last few episodes. I did that all in one big recording session and did not realize that the playback on my capture card was going. Okay, one second. Nope, I know who this is. But if you noticed an echo in the last several episodes, that's why. I tried to cut out as much of it as I could, but really not a whole lot I could do because it was a, it was it was attached to the same audio that my my audio of me talking it was attached to, and I don't have it very sophisticated video editing software, so I cannot like cut out individual sound bites. I wish I could. If I had something a little bit more advanced, then I would be able to. Alright, so... Go ahead. I'm running the right way. Now, this one will either be one that I'm able to defeat really quickly, or this one will take a while. Depends on how lucky I get with some of these shots. We always got that our eagle buddy flying uh, as we run. I'm thinking. I don't know. I kind of just lost my train of thought right there. I need to take a. Uh, <clears throat> searching on your own becomes slightly more difficult as you go with the addition of... No. Okay, another cave. I'm guessing there must be a special lizard. Oh. Because those other ones did not seem to be doing anything for me. Oh, the horse does not want to go at any real speed. I guess I can't honestly say I blame him. That would be quite a fall. Hitting the water at th this height would be like hitting concrete. The black horse with one yeah, white patch yeah, on his forehead. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't want to jump off the horse yeah, because if yeah. it throws me off the wrong side, I'll end yeah. up falling. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Once I get yeah. over this bridge, I'll be able to move normally again. It is kind of cool that he has an AI that acknowledges this is a dangerous area so he can't go, like, full gallop. Ah, here we go. I don't think there's a way of getting there without swimming. Yep. That actually hurt me a little bit. This is a beautiful location. This isn't the boss fight area, but... Huh, I wonder what's with... I wonder if there's something over there. There aren't a whole lot of, like, hidden secrets or anything. This game is 
a little bit simpler than a lot of others. Well, there, well, proof positive of that is the lack of any, like, side combat. Yeah, I am quite sure I'm getting to these areas where these things are a lot faster than I used to. There, okay, so that's how I can jump higher. Ooh, climb. When I was younger, that jump would take me forever because I always had trouble with like those backward jumps. Oh, well. Platforming isn't necessarily my highest skill. Oh, cutscene. It doesn't sound happy. I'm going to need this. The trouble is you gotta get down pretty quickly. Oh, hey. And stab him at me. Well, that's his crotch. Oh, he doesn't approve. Hi. You're not happy with me right now. I can understand that. I did just stab you in the crotch. I wouldn't be very happy with the person who did that either. It is better to be on the lower floors when you're doing this so you don't have to go down as far and therefore you got more time. Oh. Oh, hi. Ow. Oh, hey, that stuff actually... Oh, crud, I didn't know that. I didn't realize that stuff did constant damage. Okay. I guess we'll be right back, guys. Alright, guys, we are back. So, I think I just figured out something. The higher up he is when he falls, the longer he is stunned. Because I actually had already, I tried this once before, I was trying to get him back to about where we were left in that, health-wise. Okay, so you're okay. And... That sword. Okay, why isn't there one that's tied specifically to the bow? Left and right on the D-pad, just switch. Well... 
the up and down do the sword and the free hand. I need to go higher. I got him about halfway again. What I need to do is get him to fall really far again so that he gets stunned for quite a long time. I think I'm back at the top now. I went too high. Stupid cloud. I of all the times I've ever played this, I've never had to do that cloud I've never like been stuck in that cloud where it was like constantly doing damage to me. Oh crud. Not worth it to take that little bit of damage just to be able to really get at him quick uh, just to get down here quickly and... ah okay well we got him actually rather quickly this time those dead hollowed eyes. Ah! Oh, the tentacles. Run. They won't get oh, well, they got me. Through the floor. Oh, I think we got time for one more Colossus this episode. Let's see which one it is. Wall scaler. She's getting up! Yay! Oh, more people. Run for your lives! And another one. Now, we're going to take a look at our character's face, and you might notice something odd. Nope. Nope, she's not really awake yet. Darn it. Here we thought our journey was over. Look at his skin. Mighty voice booming through the ceiling. This guy. Oh, this guy. Oh boy. This one's gonna take a while. I might actually end up just jumping to when we get there. Uh, I'll see how long it takes me, because, well, maybe this one, maybe it won't take too long. You get here fast. You get here faster than I, uh, almost as fast as I respawn. Yeah. 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 This is actually yeah. my favorite. Yeah. 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 This Colossus is my favorite. Oh, darn it. Sword. Should be this way, I believe? Yes. Yeah. Oh, 
Well, maybe it won't take too long to get there. Well, where's that? There's the bridge. Yeah. Yeah, there are actually two little bridges over here. One goes over the lake of that where we fought the second Colossus. This one yeah. goes a little bit to the left. Yeah, yeah. Well, maybe this one won't take too long to get to. Ah, I don't know. It just feels like it. You get to places faster in this game. Another lizard. Not gonna bother with him. Didn't seem to do anything. Yeah, yeah. I bet we're going toward that big, creepy black cloud. Yeah. There's another one of those yeah. save points. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I need to figure out how do I get down there. We will probably show off a mechanic that I don't use very often. Yeah, look, more lizards. Alright. I'm going to need... This. Yeah. Oh, hi. Yeah, that didn't take too long at all. I like how the atmosphere just really changed. Yeah. Now you see yeah. these jets of water? Those are going to become very important later. See this giant cave? Yeah. Take a while, guess what's in there? This is another one where you can't just like grab onto his leg. Yeah, yeah. Oh crud. Come this way, big guy. Oh. Oh. Get off the horse, dang it. Got it. Yes, you have to use the water jets to lift him up in the air. You can then uh, do this. Yeah. Now you are on quite a bit of a timer because as soon as he rolls over, you are you know, you're in trouble. He's standing up. Oh, okay, he just flung me up top where I need to be. Sweet. Look at this, he's got like a valley in the in his spine. Okay. Come on. Oh crap. Oh.
No, no. Okay, yeah, I actually did do that on purpose. <laughs> Believe it or not. <laughs> Camera gets a little. Is that his head? Where's his head? That's his tail. Let me go this way. Sadly, there's nothing for me to really grab. All I can do is like crouch down and try to hold my position. Oh, come on. Dash for that head. Oh, come on. Well, I can't get onto him now. Oh, crud. Ha ha. Got you now. are not happy with my actions. I'm not happy with you. Okay, he's a giant. He's a cool turtle. Man, is he not giving an inch. Yeah, the turtle here is actually one of my favorite. He can be a lot more difficult than I made that look. I just got really lucky because it's a combination of you have to get him to stand over that, uh, the water spout at the same time that it's going to fire. Because if you get him there too late, it'll have already fired and he'll have time to move out of the way. Like, he doesn't, I don't think he consciously moves out of the way. He just does from trying to get you. And the giant turtle is defeated. I think it almost would have been cooler had there almost been like a castle on his back. But these creatures kind of have a design more as if they are naturally created, as well, naturally as could happen in this. No! Aw, I was hoping I could get to the horse. No luck. I can see a temple over there. Goodbye, cruel world. And reincarnation. Alright, well, I think that was pretty good. We took care of two colossi in a pretty decent amount of time. Slumbering Caveman. That's a weird name for him. I like tur a giant turtle. Alright, well, that's going to wrap up this episode. I hope you enjoyed. Remember to let me know if you have any questions, comments. Tell me what you think of this series. Have a good rest of your day. This is Aaron. Signing out. Bye.